Hello everyone. We are excited to be part of DesignCon 2023. I am Madhubita Sanyal. I am the technical product manager for Synopsys High Speed Ethernet IP. And here we are showcasing Synopsys 224 gig Ethernet solution, the transmitter performance. So 224 gig Serdi's transmitter is transmitting PRBS pattern and it's going to the key site oscilloscope. And as you can see, the transmitter eye is quite wide open, showing very low jitter and very good RLM. This concludes our demonstration for the PAM4 modulation support from 224 gig Ethernet IP and it is it has various applications across pluggable near package optics, co-package optics and we are showcasing the successful interoperability with the ecosystem. We are demonstrating here synopsis, very low power 112 gig long reach phi with an extra long reach channel and without using any advanced MLSC DSP. So in this demonstration, we are showcasing the Synopsys EVP, the test chip, which is a 112 gig long reach Serdis. It is inside the socket. Transmitter is transmitting PRBS 31 pattern. It is going through the Amphenol MCBs, they are denseling connectors to and looping back to a with a two meter DAC to the MCB and going back to Synopsys 112 gig long reach receiver. Here in the monitor, we are showing different plots. You can see wide open receiver eye and the bit error rate is extremely good, which is 70 minus nine. You can see the bathtub plots on the right hand side and we are also showcasing the ADC output histogram scatter and the post DSP uh, histogram scatter. This concludes the Synopsys 112 gig long reach phi demonstration with the extra long reach channel. We are showcasing excellent performance of Synopsys 112 gig long reach Serdis with multi-lane channel. In this demonstration, we are showcasing our Synopsys 112 gig long reach Phi test chip, which is located under the socket, as you can see here. And transmitter is transmitting PRBS 31 pattern. It is going through the multi-lane ISI channel and it's looping back to the Synopsys receiver. The total channel loss here is around uh, long reach which is around 35 dB and next we'll show the graphical user interface as you can see in the graphical user interface the prefect bit error rate is 6 e minus 10 which is six orders of magnitude better than the spec and this is without any advanced DSP or MLSD and as you can see very wide open receiver eyes here and the bathtub plots, also the ADC output histogram and the post DSP histogram. So in this demonstration, we have both a transmitter setup as well as a receiver setup. So the key side BART here is transmitting PRBS 31 pattern and it's going through a channel which consists of a backplane as well as a riser card and it amounts to about 33 dB insertion loss and it is going to the synopsis receiver. The receiver is looping back to the transmitter and then it is going back to the BERT er error detector. And there is the other lane transmitter which is transmitting a PRBS pattern to the key side scope and this one is showing the excellent SNDR measurement which is around 38 dB. So this concludes our demonstration for both PCI Gen 6 transmitter and receiver. We are showcasing excellent performance of Synopsys PCI Gen 6 IP. We are demonstrating here both transmitter and receiver performance. So we have our test chip, which is under the socket in the evaluation board. 
on my uh, right hand side, extreme right, and the transmitter is transmitting PRBS H1 pattern and it is directly going to the scope. And as you can see in the monitor, wide open transmitter eye showing very good linearity and RLM, and very low jitter. And the other setup here is the Anritsu BART. The BART is transmitting PRBS 31 pattern and it is going through the channel which consists of one back plane and a riser card. Amounts to around 34, 35 dB channel and it's going to the Synopsys 5 receiver. The receiver is looping back internally to the transmitter and going back to the BART. Uh, in the BART, you can see the bit error rate here which is basically 2e minus 9 and in the synopsis graphical user interface you can see from our receiver with this channel it is uh, compensating the uh, impairments of the channel and showcasing an excellent bit error rate of 1e minus 9 and in the GUI interface you can also see the wide open receiver eyes and the bathtub plots as well as the ADC output and the post DSP output. Thank you for watching.